over here. So you know Kaylin who's usually doing these vlog things? Well, she's not gonna be here today. It's just gonna be me. I have something a little more serious to talk about. And Kaylin, she doesn't really like to discuss things that aren't happy and fun and stuff, but sometimes you got to. Because today's question is, have you ever wanted to kill yourself and or die? Oh, I know, that's like way too intense for Caitlyn, right? That's why I'm here. You see, what Caitlyn may not want you to know is that she struggles with that a lot. Psh, that's preposterous. She's such a wonderful person with happy life and a beautiful face and she's got everything going for her. That may be what you see, but that is not always what you feel. Suicide in our society is kind of a ha ah, topic. I don't really know how to deal with this. And just as a disclaimer, I may work at a counseling company, but I am not a counselor. What I feel like the most sincere way to talk to you about this is from the perspective of someone who deals with it. I've seen therapists, I've taken medication, I've gone to church, and nothing has ever seemed to take away the feeling that I'm not worth anything. Now sometimes it gets better, and sometimes it gets worse, and during those worst times is when I feel most like I don't want to keep living. Now, I have never attempted suicide, nor do I believe that I ever would attempt suicide, because it's against what I believe, like I don't think that you should actually take your life. But at times, sometimes, it doesn't feel like life is worth living. And that's a really hard thing to deal with. Kaylin has been dealing with things that have made her be on the low end of that scale recently, and people don't always realize that, but that is where she is. So my point in making this video is, one, to make sure that if you have ever felt this way, or feel this way now, that you know that you are not alone. Yeah, 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 everybody tells you that, but I am telling you from the perspective of someone who feels this way that you are not alone and that you should seek help because therapy and medications and religion and all kinds of things like friends, they are helpful. It's very possible that this feeling is never actually going to go away. I hope that maybe it does eventually in my life, but from what I've experienced so far, it's something that I have to fight and you should keep fighting too. And my second point is that if you have never felt this way and you can't even fathom feeling this way, there are probably people around you who do feel this way and you may not know that and they may actually be afraid of telling you it even though you could provide help for them because they think that you'll judge them. Only in my very closest relationships have I ever opened up about my feelings of suicide and depression Sometimes it's worked out and sometimes not so much. I've had people tell me that I just need to get over it, that I'm being overreactive. I've had other people feel like it was their fault that I felt that way even though they had nothing to do with it and somehow it all turned into this thing about them and just kind of made me feel worse. I've also had people who don't entirely understand it like my college boyfriend. He actually went to my college's counseling center and told them that I was suicidal when I wasn't actually going to commit suicide nor did I have a plan and though it's good and friends should do that if you feel like someone is a threat to your life um, it can also be very embarrassing for the person who um, is dealing with it and can kind of make it worse <laughs> in the end it all worked out but what I'm saying is that if you don't necessarily understand these kinds of feelings and you come upon someone who's going through this um, I would recommend talking to them, talking to counselors, but not judging them or freaking out or anything because that actually makes it worse. So I know that this is not Caitlyn's chipper, happy, woohoo videos, but sometimes you just have to talk about things that are real, and this is real. If you are watching this and feel this way, there are some links that I put down in the doobly-doo that can be some awesome help for you, and just talk to someone and, you know, show them this video. Tell them not to be judgy because talking is processing and processing is what you need. You are loved whether you think you are or not. We'll let Kaylin rest and overcome our demons and we'll see you next Thursday.